power tools. Paint. Passion. 86-year-old Carmen Romero and 89-year-old Jose Navarro watched the student volunteers from the mainland work to rebuild their roof on the house they called home for the past 60 years. After Hurricane Maria destroyed the couple's house, they were stranded with no help till the mailman saved them. Encantado. Este, encantado. Porque ellos vinieron por el cartero. ¿El cartero? El cartero que trae carta es que, que estaba aquí pendiente a nosotros todo el tiempo. A local pastor, actually a mail carrier, uh, connected us with Carmen, the homeowner here, and we were able to see her house, and we came in and assessed the damage and realized that she needed a new roof. Send Relief, a volunteer program who has been on the island since October, is repairing Carmen and Jose's home through FEMA's Valor program, standing for a volunteer agencies leading and organizing repair. Under this pilot initiative, volunteer organizations use building supplies purchased by FEMA to repair damaged homes. Hurricane Maria damaged 250,000 homes in Puerto Rico. Through the Valor program, FEMA has helped rebuild more than 337 homes and has a goal of helping a total of 1,600 homes on the island. It may be a small number, but to the people on the receiving end, it means the world. We currently have 150 college students um, spread out all over uh, Puerto Rico, and I believe that as of today, I think we have 28 jobs going as of right now. Jamie Wilson, a sophomore at East Tennessee State University, is spending her whole spring break helping rebuild. When I got here and I saw the need for help, I was like, wow, like my assignments, that's not going to matter in 20 years. What matters is helping people who need it. Norm Hale, the Sun Relief team leader, missionary for 35 years and a grandfather to 14, says he loves helping others. I seem to come in with a house with no roof and they can leave seeing the roof is on. Very good how he's just like determined to get this done and so if we get sidetracked he always gets us back on the job. Be a blessing to them but it ends up being a blessing for us. The resilience of the Puerto Ricans is phenomenal. In Carolina, Puerto Rico, Amanda Mason, Cronkite News.